Here's Sean Phillips and Coach, you were prophetic earlier this week. You said the team that made the last play in this game was going to be the winner. You guys made the last play in overtime. Yeah, I didn't quite think it would work out exactly like this, but you know, Oakland, uh, it's not a surprise that they came in and carried the game to us. They've, they've been a very good team all year, especially in league play, and, and probably an underappreciated ability of theirs is to get results on the road this year. Uh, their deserved 2-0 lead took us to the halftime, and I tell people all the time I've got a great, great staff, and all three of them, made viable suggestions on, on adjustments we needed to make. We, we changed our shape, put some different personnel in, and um, we use a phrase that I stole from the U.S. Women's National Team coach. You know, we don't have reserves, we have game changers. Uh, and we had guys come off the bench and help us change the game. Um, you know, Chino stepped in and, and uh, did what Chino does, and, and Buki came in off the bench at halftime and got us the first goal, which, which gave us the belief Zulu came in and, and made an impact, and then obviously he comes in with the game-winning play. So, you know, this this team continues to um, make me go back to whatever doesn't kill you makes you stronger, and, and we continue to, to get stronger. And We have to look ahead to, to our next opponent after reviewing the, the challenges we still have with ourselves. We have to get better, and, and we're going to have to as we get into late October and early November. We've got to start to tighten things up defensively and um, continue to find that balance of, of attack and defense and you know maybe win a game two to nothing instead of three to two in overtime at, at the knife's edge which we've been doing lately but there's something about that there's a there's a fight in the spirit within this group that uh, there's a belief that no matter what's happening they're, they're going to find a way to win which is which is an important attribute and speaking of that fight and that spirit these last two home matches now have gone to overtime. You guys have gotten the wins. And it's been guys, those game changers off the bench, that have made the most impact in regulation late and in overtime. Is there anyone on this team, on that bench, who's not ready for their number to be called, not ready to go in and make an impact at a moment's notice? Well, coming up down at this point, going all the way back to the first game of the year, when we went, we were bringing, we've had a number of different guys play this year. And every single guy helped us get a result. Um, I truly believe any single guy in that that has that uniform on during the game can help us. Uh, and it comes down to you know, the coach's decision at that point of, or maybe what the game is showing. But this staff has complete confidence in, in any single guy in this team to put them out there and, and make a mark and change the game for us. Change the game they did. Another win here at home and a good start to the stretch run. Congratulations, Sean. Thank you.